Hello guys, Captain Alex Mason here. Um, we're going to continue Call of Duty Heroes with the North Europe Mission 2. Yeah, Mission 2. Alright, let's see how this works. Well, that doesn't make any sense. On my way. Got it. Got it. Got it. Come on, no, you bastard. I need to keep you alive. You know, sometimes this thing just... Oh my god, you fucking asshole. Okay, that's not what I wanted you to attack, but okay. The patch, the update must have, like, changed everything, because... According to the guy's video that I watched... He said all he needed to do was put 10 juggernauts there and 10 juggernauts there. And then two snipers down there, but I guess that didn't work. And I was trying to get the 3-star. So, we're just going to have to settle for 1-star at least. And If I can get that far at least. I don't know. It all depends on how he wants to play at this. He should be fine as long as he stays away from these two sentry guns. I just want him to basically take the out er, laying layers, at least get the base, because the base um, will, I don't know if you can see it, will do a lot more damage. Because the base basically controls everything, it's literally the nerve center of the entire op. In case you can't see the battle damage, I got 42% damage, like, done to the space. Oh, and, and regardless of what you guys say, I still believe that this is canon, because they have all the main characters, basically. My only question, though, is if it were, what timeline would, like, what year would it be? Would it be after the events of Call of Duty 4, or...? Because, you also gotta keep in mind that Soap is still alive, Riley, Lieutenant Simon Ghost Riley is still alive, and... Um, what's his face? Commander Yuri is still alive. Well, the base is... their base, or their command center is almost destroyed. I have Sergeant Walcroft and Commander Yuri unlocked. 
price they automatically give you. Fifty two per cent. Now it's fifty Come on, blow up. There, we got one star. So, you at least need one star to qualify as a victory. I was trying to get five or er, three stars, but I guess that's not possible right now. Yeah, I want you to attack that first. I just want to kind of see how far he can get before he has to get inside because he's the only troop I have, soldier I have left, and there are two sentry guns. And there's the minefield there. I'm going to at least try and see if I can get two stars. Oh wow, he can shoot from there? Okay, that works. I've dealt 64% damage to this entire base. Oh, and if you guys want to see the end credits, that's um, in the options, but I'm going to show it anyway, the best I can anyway, because what, with my phone being recorded with my computer and it's kind of, like, reflecting a bit, causes, like, issues in the brightness of the... So it's, um... Gold storage is just about ready to be destroyed. No. You were going that way. Alright, well, he dealt two stars. That's acceptable. But now I gotta let him heal because he's dead. I just kind of want to scout um, Mission 3 and see what it's like. You've got to be kidding, right? Alright. 
So I'm gonna give my crack. I'm gonna give a crack at um mission three, and I'll be back once I get um mission two up to three stars again. Well, this time I'm gonna train as much juggernauts as I possibly can. And I gotta wait 38 minutes for Price to return if I ever want to use him. Which I'm not. Alright, well, it said I'm Captain Alex Mason. I'll see you guys in the next mission. Wait, before I do, I want to check. What's the last front we have? South Asia is the last, like, location we have before... Um, this game's missions are over. There are, what, one, two, three, four, four missions left in the North Europe campaign that I have not yet completed. So they'll be the next thing on my list. So yeah, I'm Captain Alex Mason, I'll see you guys in like a couple of minutes.